Long queues have resurfaced in petrol stations across the federal capital territory. Motorists struggle to purchase premium motor spirit, commonly known as petrol. The queue grew gradually from Thursday and have stayed through the new week. Our correspondent, Edidiong Ibanya, tells us more. The situation is pronounced in every area of the city. Some of the filling stations remained locked while few with the products experienced endless queues exacerbating the frustration among motorists. Some drivers have lamented the inconsistency and unavailability of fuel coupled with the soaring prices. Motorists that spoke with ADBN News expressed dismay at the condition of accessing fuel in the country. I've been here as early as 6.37. Honestly, it's a very sad situation. It's painful, you know, that in a country like ours, where we have this commodity, fuel, we're suffering. You know, it's really, really sad. And the painful part of it is God has even given us an opportunity. We have someone who has even built a refinery here, the Dangote refinery. I spent almost three or four hours now, since morning. I don't know why. You can see, since around uh, 8 o'clock, I'm in the queue at Total Philly Station, first headquarters area 11. Up to now, I never get the foil. I'm still in the queue. So I don't really know the country we are today. We are suffering. We with our foil, we are suffering to get foil. Some Philly Station, you even buy the foil, it's not, you don't even read the liter. We will buy foil before you know foil don't finish. However, the scarcity has also provided an opportunity for black marketers who have been spotted along roads and outside filling stations, capitalizing on the shortage by selling at exorbitant prices as high as a thousand naira per litre. To drive, to go somewhere, not a problem. To go and see a family, not a problem, fuel. So to come and work, not a problem, fuel. So now, where, where are they here since now? Fuel now. Fuel, if I get the fuel now, like people they do Tazik, they must add another uh, money again to transport because of to get the exactly the thing where they want to get, get to chop. Yesterday I bought three uh, eight, eight fifty per liter. Eh? So I find that this place is cheaper than me. Down. So I now queue. It's been days since the fuel scarcity began and still lingers. As the situation continues, many can only hope that the cost of the scarcity will be addressed quickly to ease the hardships on Nigerians. Edidion Ibanga, ADBN News.